So angle two is congruent to angle three. Uh, we know that because that's given. Um, angle one is congruent to angle two. And angle four is congruent to angle three. How do we know that? Because they're vertical angles and vertical uh, angles imply congruent. So what's true about these two angles, angles two and three? Well, at the beginning, we said that angles two and three are congruent. So the angles are congruent. All right, so angle two is congruent to three. Uh, angle one is congruent to two. Angle two is congruent to three. Um, so we can use the transitive property. Uh, angle one is congruent to two. Angle two is congruent to three. Angle three is congruent to two. So. We can use the transitive property. Angle one is congruent to angle four. And we're done.